Thanks for joining us as we welcome you today for Sunday afternoon football. Anthony Hudson here. Welcome to the MCG. We couldn't have asked for better conditions here. With me today is Gary Lyon. Hey, Hutto, really looking forward to the start of this one. Today we have Melbourne coming up against the Bulldogs. They're looking sharp, and the crowd are appreciating it. The banners look great as the players get set to run through them. It's a big day for the Western Bulldogs court. If they can get on top of the Melbourne defence, they'll go a long way to winning the game. and the crowd are appreciating it. I'm really looking forward to seeing how they play today. Yes, Hutto. The captains make their way to the middle for the toss. Western Bulldog winning the toss. These lineups look very strong, and both teams look fired up and set to go. The opening siren is moments away, and you can feel the excitement building. And here's the bounce to launch the festivities. Gorn won the tap. Brayshaw with a clean collect. Ends up turning this ball over. Wood elects to kick. Steady hands there as he holds that one. English has resources out wide. The ball goes over the boundary near the 50. What can you tell us, Gaz? This is a classic game we're seeing right now. Guides it down. The umpire will ball it up. Slapped away. He gets his hands on the footy. The umpire will ball it up. Gorn slaps it away. Bottom pallet turns a free kick. Looks up with a kick. Open opportunity for McLean. 45 metres out. Goes for the goals. Just couldn't get the curve half. The lead is now one. Ready to bring it back into play. Decides to play on. Gorn goes with the kick. Bruce presents and takes the mark. 35 metres out. Going for goal number one. He kicks that goal with purpose. No doubt about it. Bruce getting the crowd involved. They draw first blood. The umpire set the bounce to restart the game. With the ball now. Rushes with the kick. A strong mark in the pack from Spargo. Moves the ball by foot. Petrarca runs after this one. The ball knocked out in the tackle. Has it now. He's got the football now. No issues with that drop mark. Celebrating hard. Melbourne sink their first. Back in the middle now. Brown won it down. Hunter didn't see what was coming. A full body tackle. Great attack on the ball carrier. Good mark and looks to send it back. Moved on by Wallace. Johannesson wins the ball in the air. Uses it across half back. Jeray found some space and marked. A big contested grab. Just gave it away. Oliver rushes with the kick. Hannon couldn't keep his hands on it. Going for goal number one. Hunter delivers with the goal. Smiles all round. That's two in a row for the Demons. Melbourne, grab the lead. We resume hostilities. 
thrashes it. Takes possession. Dug out the loose ball. Brilliant chase. Gathers it now. Gathered by Harms. Quick handball. Neil Bullen gets the ball. Melbourne fans getting excited about that one. Look at him. He really enjoyed that one. Now they lead by 11. This is how they can score, Big Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. A great bit of play that resulted in that one. The game is back underway. Brown won the hit out. Jones running off for a break. Ball up in the centre square. What can you tell us, Gaz? It's a really entertaining game of football. The ball spills in the tackle. The tackle slipped high and results in a free. Sinks the slipper into it, finds a target. Kick by Norton. The mark is taken by McRae. He's a long way from home, but he might have the wheels. Doing well to intercept that kick. Goes with the kick. He wins the ball in the air. Almost cut it off. Salem just put it on the boot. Taking a nice grab. Melbourne could have been giving the opposition a chance to move the ball around freely, which is working because they're getting on top once they force a contest. Liberatore takes it well. May takes a strong mark. Uses it by foot. Oh, he did everything right except take the mark. He's accepted. Gives a don't argue. Kicks the ball deep. The ball goes to ground. Hibbert hacking it out of there. Spills the mark. The ball bubbling around. Moves the ball along the wing. Goes for territory. Salem just put it on the boot. The ball ends up going to ground. Just gets it onto the boot. Wood can test the hard ball. Ball collected. Shrugs the tackle. Brown ran it best. Dug it out. May can't hold on to the tackle. Gets around Mr. Invisible. Sweeping handball from Bontempelli. He gains possession. Norton has a teammate on the move. Mark by Dixon. He takes the shot. Listen to the fans celebrate as he drives that through. Yes, hello. That's his first. Congratulated by his teammates. About to resume hostilities. Brown does well. He lays off the pass. Finds his man. Snaffled up by McDonald. Didn't get away from that tackle. Great tackle. Ball gets cut off. Brown just threw it. The kick from Norton. A great mark taken there. Chips it towards half forward. Connor Jasny releases the ball. Hurried kick. Off hands from Suckling. Dale puts his body on the line. Decides to kick. The end of the final term sees the scores stand in Melbourne 18 to Western Bulldogs 13. Melbourne could have to be happy with that first term. Hunter missed an opportunity to mark. Any thoughts from you, Gaz? Western Bulldogs are doing well to control the ball in the air. They are getting to the right spot. We're ready for second quarter action. Umpire ready to resume play. Gorn with a big fist on it. Ball up called. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. A solid mark from May. Slams it on the boot. Doing well with the mark. Gets a touch to the ball. The ball's knocked loose. He has the ball. 
Soccer's the kick. Joe Hannison. Short by hand. McLean finds a way to hang on. Great tackling there, Hutto. Dropped the mark. He should have taken. The ball mopped up. I hope that's not serious. But boy, he looks to be in a lot of pain. Harms doesn't look likely to come back on. McDonald brings it out of the pack. Applies a bump. They can link up now. Gorn needs to live. Maybe the coach needs to get on the phone to him and give him some instructions. Big tackle. A lot of possessions for him. Takes possession. May was taken high in the tackle. Colin Jasny has resources out wide. Tomlinson uses it by foot. Well collected. Bonson Pally with quick hands. Uses the bump. Does well to cut off the kick. Uses it now. Libertore leading the race to the loose ball. Jones has resources out wide. I'll have it. Swatson looks up with the kick. Daniel goes for territory. Wins the race to the ball. May with a penetrating handball. Norton finds possession. Langdon unable to hold on. Quick hands, and they could be away here. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. Slams it home. That will settle the nerves. Gets his first on the ball. Hunter couldn't be happier with that goal. Western Bulldogs back in front. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. It's great to watch Hutto. Plenty of excitement. Back in the middle now. Punches it clear. Ends up with Hunter. Constant pressure and rewarded. Drives it out of the pack. He drives it. Strong mark in the contest. Bruce takes a strong mark. Goes by foot. The contest, no match for him. I agree with you there, Hutto. 50 metres from home. He goes for broke. What a goal! They get around him after that effort. Western Bulldogs have kicked the last three goals. Now they lead by seven. Couldn't snaffle it. McDonald hacking it out of there. Neil Bullen dishes it off. Hands that ball to the opposition. Linking by hand. Dixon won himself a free. Puts it on the boot. Bonson Pally wins the marking contest. 45 metres out. Move it on. Going for goal number one. What a sensational goal. Look at them celebrate that effort. That's four in a row for the Bulldogs. The margin is 13. Clears the contest. He wins possession. Goes by hand. Just gets it onto the boot. Terrific mark there. 40 metres from home. He heads for home. It looked impossible, but he made it work. He puts through his first goal. Melchuk celebrating hard. The Demons behind by seven. Centre bounce. Big thump from Gorn. He's got the footy in his hands. Wallace gets the handball away. With the ball is McLean. Bruce looks to convert this opportunity. Miss for a behind. Western Bulldogs by eight points. Western Bulldogs are costing themselves with turnover today. They need to find a way to control the play better and stop turning it over. Did well to get a hand in. Jetta picks up the loose ball. The umpire calls for a stoppage. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? There's some great skills on display right now. It's a great match. Coaches love to see that kind of tackling pressure. No problems with that kick for Daniel. 
He's excited about that one. Western Bulldog. Clee is now 14. Thump clear. A chance for Gorn. A strong pack mark. A spearing kick from McDonald. Collects the loose ball. He looks like he needs a spell. Looks like the ball will be coming back. English has resources out wide. Pontempelli goes with the kick. Kolodziejewski will be the recipient of the free. Kolodziejewski has resources out wide. A chance to reload the attack now. Chose to kick it. Wallace leading the race to the loose ball. Gained some territory. Finding the loose ball was Wood. He just can't get out of the action. Only seconds remaining in this quarter. Can't take possession. Hands that ball to the opposition. He makes that kick count. Full price. Colin Jasny loves that goal. The Demons now only trail by eight. Western Bulldogs are taking advantage of the Ruckman's ability. It's giving the Melbourne trailing by eight at half time. Western Bulldogs have had a solid first half and will look to show more of the same in the second. Time to take a look at the stats. Western Bulldogs are doing a good job at cutting off the opposition attacks. Their intercept game is a key part of their defence. Thanks, Gary. With so much on the line, I'm looking forward to this second half. Second half action about to commence. We're back in motion. Clears the contest. Fails to fend off the tackler. Showing some really good pressure there. Intercepts the ball well. Western Bulldogs are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. The players will be feeling the heat right now. Alex to kick. Norton unable to lay the tackle. Hibbert puts on a big hit. Manufactures the handball. Slams it onto the boot. Doesn't hold onto the mark. Harm steers it towards goals. That looked great. What a goal. That's his first. His teammates rush over. Melbourne could kick back-to-back -back goals. There's nothing in this. Hits the target by hand. McLean wins it back. Picking it up was Hunter. Is in his possession. Hibbert couldn't keep his hands on it. Picked off the deck. Sockers it forward. The loose ball picked up. Touch across the line. Spargo weighing up the options now. With a driving kick. He's in charge of the ranking points. He's doing everything right. Outstanding pressure. Lloyd loves that goal. Western Bulldogs starting to exert some dominance now. They lead 45 to 36. Duray moves it now. A lot of possessions for him. Ball hits the deck. Kicks hurriedly. He decides to go for home. A chance to soccer it and kicks the goal. Dunkley loved kicking that one. Western Bulldogs by 15 points. Center bounce. Hammers it. The bounce made it tough. Colin Jasny wins the foot race. Just gets a boot to it. Goes off the ground. Wins the race to the ball. Nails the goal. McDonald couldn't be happier with that goal. Melbourne behind by nine. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. Western Bulldogs are doing a good job at getting the ball forward. They lead the inside 50s and they're creating plenty of problems for the opposition defence. Salem manufactures a handball. Brace your tries, he's like a goal. He acknowledges the crowd. Melbourne have kicked the last two goals. 
Melbourne close the gap to three. Ball stripped in the tackle. Dunkley dug out the loose ball. Puts boot to ball. Just dismisses his opponent. Tries to gain some territory. Marks now and can send it back. Kick by Dale. Good body work to win the mark. It's a turnover. Not sure what the problem is from here, but something is definitely wrong. Gaz, can you give us more on that? Doesn't look good, Hutto. It's hard to see him coming back on. The game has tightened right up. Thank you. Thumps it clear. Langdon picks it up. Using every ounce of energy he has left. Releases by hand. Brown drives the kick. Richards not getting much of it, Gaz. You're right, Hutto. He's gone missing lately. What a lovely goal from there. Hannon can put through his first. He loved that one. They've taken the lead. About to resume play. Thrashes it. Has it now. Melcher doesn't take the mark. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Well, he hasn't had the impact we were expecting. Punches are clear. Richards gains some territory. Jetta collects the loose ball. Keeps it moving. Going for goal number one. Nobody can hold on here. Off the ground. And it's a goal for Joel Jasny. Gets some reward for his efforts. Melbourne have four on the trot. Nine points the difference. Punched away. Taken by Langdon. Quick handball. Bonson Palick is blowing hard after that effort. Thump clear. We'll get a ball up. Swats it. Doing well with Liberatore. Pushes through with power. We've got a whistle. The kick from Wallace. Johannesson takes the mark and contested. Got boot to ball. Well taken at ground level. Tomlinson hacks it out of there. Spent that one before he earned it. Just goes bang! A great defensive effort. Here's Williams. Lloyd takes it well. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Melbourne forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Looks to move it by foot. Brayshaw looks to get onto the football. He gives away a free for in the back. Chips it towards half forward. The ball finds Jowers. Keeps the kick low. Duray. There to mop up. Gets the loose ball. Brilliant stuff. And he puts it through. McLean celebrates with the fans. Oh, there's nothing in this now. That's a really good team goal. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. Melbourne keep turning the ball over from their forward thrust. If they can hit more teammates, they can increase the lead. Turned it over. Picked up by Palms. Gorn onto the ball. Couldn't quite with the mark. Ball picked up. Trengo goes off the ground. Missed the target. We'll have another ball up. It's a big stage of this game. Swats it. Moves it by foot. Wallace puts it on the boot. The ball spells the Gowers. Picked off the deck. Wallace will be the recipient of the free. Moves the ball by foot. The mark has been taken. Three-quarter time. Melbourne, 60. Plays Western Bulldogs, 57. A quarter of footy to go. Melbourne will be looking to not only hold their lead, but they want to put this beyond doubt early and run away with a big win. A high-scoring third term sees opportunity for both sides heading into the final quarter. What do the stats tell us, Gaz? Melbourne are falling behind in the contested possessions. They don't want to give the opposition a chance to get back into it.
Thanks for that, Gary. Let's see what this last quarter throws up. Can't afford any mistakes from here. They have to be perfect. Hammers it. Bonson Pally has the ball. Wants to keep it moving. Hurry kick. Great grab. An easy grab for English. Goes the long option. Suckley takes the mark. Going for goal number one. What a kick. And he puts it through. He's enjoying that goal. Western Bulldogs steal back the lead. Big thump from Gorn. Soccer's a kick. Needs a bit of a rest. Handballs. Oliver launches towards goal. Pretty happy with that one. Melbourne take back the lead. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. He did really well there and gets the reward. Melbourne need to think more about the kick going forward. They're just bombing it in and it's getting cut off at the moment. Uses it now. Sockers it forward. Intercepted. Harms just through it. Moves the ball by foot. Libertore has a great set of hands. Libertore has resources out wide. Daniel slams it under the boot. They'll regain the lead if he nails this one. He's excited about that one. Western Bulldogs get on top again. The game is back underway. Thump by Gorn. Looks to move it by foot. Tackle knocks the ball loose. Hibbert handballs out in front. Norton steals possession. He gains possession. Dale needs a chance to rest. Lobs the handball. The handball hits the tackle. Ball gets cut off. Pushes off the tackle. He drives it towards goal. Just leaves it in his way. Great goal. A time to celebrate. And don't they get around. Dunkley. The lead is now nine. We're back in the middle. Gorn with a big fist on it. Bruce with the ball. Awkwardly got the handball out. Links with hands. English is streaming past and gets the footy. Got boot to ball. Lever marks in a bit of space. Western Bulldogs just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Neil Bullock is blowing hard after that effort. Langdon gets a quick kick away. Bounces over the line. Bruce coming off for a spell. Lots of pressure out there at the minute. Ball tossed back in. Punched away. It'll be a ball up right near the boundary line. Thumps it clear. Hunt was taken high in the tackle. Puts it on the boot. Nice hands. 30 metres from home. Going for goal number two. Puts it right through the middle. His teammates rush over. Melbourne reduce the margin. Thump clear. He's got the football now. Dunkley might have overworked himself there. May does well to mark. With a driving kick. Jenna got under it. Jenna throws the ball away. They can take the sting right out of the game here. Daniel unloads one towards goal. A drop punch through the goals. Look at him. He really enjoyed that one. Western Bulldogs, Fleet Melbourne, 81 to 72. It's great to watch Hutto, plenty of excitement. Some great ball movement there, you just knew they were going to score. About to resume hostilities.
is the contest. Unable to create the space. Fantastic tackle. Great tackling technique. He looks like he needs a spell. Jenner comes away with the ball. The ball in the hands of Colin Jasny. Off the deck. Daniel slick with the hands. Gives it to McLean. McDonald spills it. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. He needs to find a way into this game. Just put it on the boot. May off the deck. Sweeping handball. Gives the old don't argue. Penetrating handball. Quickly onto the boot. Petrarca leaps over the top. Western Bulldogs haven't been able to sit up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect the forward to kick a winning total that one. Hannon dishes it off. He slots this one. A big goal there. Colin Jasny puts through his third goal. Pretty happy with that one. Back in the middle now as the Rucks go at it. Gorn clears the contest. Jeray wins the ball in the air. Uses it by foot. Ends up marking uncontested. Gets a hand in. A clean collect. Jones struggling to run at the moment. Unbelievable effort. And it ends with a goal. He acknowledges the crowd. That's two in a row for Melbourne. Melbourne. Go back in the lead again. Hunter gets the loose ball. Finds the loose ball. Just gets a boot to it. Neil Bullen goes for territory. Gathers it now. With the ball now. Brayshaw kicks hurriedly. Just gives it away. You can already tell that's not so good. He looks injured. Going straight to the rooms. Doesn't look good. With quick hands. Handballs to a teammate on the run. Joe Henderson hunting with authority. Fantastic tackle. Outstanding pressure. Dunkley with the mark. Sinks the slipper into it. Western Bulldogs so close, but couldn't quite get the win. Gary, what do you make of the result? It was just an extraordinary game of footy. And while both sides had their chances, Melbourne took theirs when they needed to. Final scores are 84 to 81. That's all for today. On behalf of myself and Gary Lyon, thanks for joining us. We'll see you again soon. Thanks, Hanno. I've enjoyed every minute of it.